And Layout Top is really great because it takes the same features that are inside of a container children align methods. Now the problem with that was that we were always limited to doing this inside of comps. Now layout top is essentially that same feature, but brought down into the top package. So for example, if I had a bunch of movie files here, take all four of these movies, plug them into the layout top, and immediately you can kind of start seeing it working in its magic. Now, if we go to the layout top, a lot of the things I like doing off the bat are scaling resolution. What this does is it builds up the resolution of the layout top based on the actual resolution of the inputs. We can do all the same types of things that we would normally do with a comp. So for example, we can set the maximum number of columns. We can do things like change the alignment here. So maybe you want to do top to bottom instead, or you could even go to doing things like aligning them in grid rows or grid columns. Not only is it just a click of a button to change between all of these, but what we can also do is see how easily it scales because what I could do is copy and paste, you know, maybe three more sets of these assets. And just by plugging all of these into the input of the layout comp, we can see that it does the magic of basically filling in that grid for me and making it look nice. The layout top is really useful. Anything from laying out grids of icons, laying out kind of thumbnails of movies in a movie player, any of these kind of things are really easy to do. And the nice thing about this is still, since this is still a top, you can then proceed to do all your processing you might want to do on it, whether you want to put some effects on it, blurs, et cetera, et cetera.